everyone, welcome back to our channel. It's Britta and Carly. We're here for another weekly favorites. Let's get right into it. Um, we like to keep these videos short, so hopefully we do. Uh, first up, I'll do our new slippers. We each got these, mm -hmm. but um, I feel like they already look worn. I've been wearing them I know. every day. They're from Target. They're just these really nice, cushiony, thick slippers. They have that, memory foam inserts. Yeah. But I think the brand is Deer Form. Deer Form? Deer Form. Foams. Deer foams. Deer foams. Um, yeah, so it's like memory foam down here, so really, really cozy. And then because it's almost like a shoe, like there's a little back, like it really keeps your foot warm. Yeah, and we like the hard bottom slippers because you can wear yeah, them inside like and things. outside. Um, they're really cute. Just really cute for winter and fall, you know. Only so, $15. Yeah, really good to have slippers and so cheap. Okay, another Target find are these leggings, and I mean, they really just look like normal black leggings, but I've been struggling to find, like, at-home leggings, if you will. I mean, I could wear these to run errands and stuff, but just loungy type leggings that aren't too thick, but more so, like, cotton and comfortable, and these ones on Target had really good reviews. They're by the brand A New Day. And um, let me see what they're made out of. So they're made out of rayon and spandex, but mm -hmm. they're very, very soft. And my favorite part about it is this waist, if you can see, it's like an elastic waistband. And you would think that would be really uncomfortable, but I feel like with a lot of my other leggings, like the waist doesn't come up high enough for my legging. Um, I don't know, I just like, I like high-waisted things in general, pants in general, um, bottoms. And so these like are high-waisted, but because of this elastic, they don't stretch out on the waist. So the waist always conforms to your natural waist which I really like I think it just makes it more comfortable it makes it more wearable you can wear them with like crop sweatshirts that would be really cute and they're just really soft they're not too long which is another thing we have short legs and so many leggings I have to roll I do have to roll these a little bit but not as much as with other brands and I think they're only like 13 maybe 15 dollars I got a size small and they fit beautifully. So I'm going to order more pairs because they're just great to like lounge in at home or you can wear them with like an oversized sweater to run errands and they're super soft and comfortable. Okay, next up is a holiday find. We're getting in that season. These are big bottle brush trees. Oh, got some fuzzies. Um, we got these at Hobby Lobby, but we saw that Target has ones that are very similar if you don't have a Hobby Lobby near you. Um, this one was $10 and this was $8, but we used a coupon, so no, they were, oh, they were, they were 50% off. That's right. Hobby Lobby generally has 50% off sales. They do it right now for holidays, and then I feel like all of November it's full price. because they No, I think it's always on sale. That's not true. Yes, I think all their stuff is generally 50% off. That's like well, how we they operate. got these for 50% off, so it was like $4 and $5, which is such a good deal. They're so cute. We like that they're a little different. They have different bases, so we put them next to each other along with this cute little nutcracker we got. Um, and they're just really easy decor for the holidays because you can yeah. stick them anywhere. And you can never have enough bottle brush trees. I feel like it's something we'll buy year after year because the colors will never really go out of style. The style itself will never go yeah, out of style. it's just a little tree. It's so cute. I love it. Next up is a drink favorite. We found these at Trader Joe's Ooh, oh, last I'm weekend. Trying. And um, this is by the brand La Colombe, and it's the Peppermint Mocha Draft Latte. And they had the pumpkin spice and then the peppermint mocha. And we love pumpkin stuff, but when it comes to like coffee drinks, we mm -hmm. always love peppermint and mocha. And I actually tried the pumpkin spice two days after trying this one, and it's not as good as this one. Yeah, so first of all, the packaging is so adorable. Whoever branded this, I just love it in general, like the color scheme. But anyways, uh, so it's cold pressed espresso and frost milk, and then they wrote dark chocolate and peppermint. The ingredient list is very short, which we love. We always look for that. It says lactose free, which is really interesting because then it says there's milk in it. Yeah, but then it also says there's something in it called lactase. So then we were like, maybe that makes it lactose free. We're not sure, yeah. but it's lactose free if you have lactose intolerance. And um, one of these is two and a fourth cups of coffee. And they're not kidding. Like you feel yes, it. it gives you so much energy way more than any drink I've ever had at Starbucks yes well um, besides like heavy espresso drinks like if you're one of those that gets an adage out of espresso in your coffee good on you but that it would probably be something like that yeah and I love that I mean um, I'm not actually gonna show you the lid I just realized how gross it is because it's just been sitting here to film this video but um they put like this little hole in the lid so you you have to sip it they force you to sip it mm -hmm. you can't chug this drink because it is so strong 
and you don't shake it, which is another thing the girl at Trader Joe's was like, when you get this, don't shake yeah, it. Yeah, like, you would sweet assume. Of her to say that because I would have shaken it. Probably. Yeah. Um. And yeah, I just think it tastes so delicious. It tastes so pure, like nothing artificial in here, and it's not too sweet, which is our thing. We don't mm -hmm. like. We actually despise sweet coffee drinks. It's so good. We want one right now. Yeah. I, I might go get one. <laughs> okay. Is this our last item? Yeah. Okay, last is the toothpaste, which is so random, but that's what these videos are. It's the Hello brand. Um, is it just called Hello? Right? Yeah. Okay, so I've had the travel toothpaste. Yeah, before. it's Hello brand and it's the activated charcoal with fresh mint and coconut oil toothpaste. And it's fluoride free. Yeah, it's fluoride free and it's like all natural. Like it says free from artificial sweeteners, flavors, dyes, fluoride, sulfates, microbeads, parabens, triclosan, dairy, and gluten. Um, obviously, there's ingredients in it, but most of it is pretty, like you know what they are. Yeah. Um, and I just wanted a more natural toothpaste. I have super sensitive teeth and I've been using Sensodyne, but sometimes I'm just like, oh, is this good for my teeth? Like, I don't know. It just makes me... And it's expensive. I don't know how comparable This it is, is expensive too. Oh. Um, not... It's actually, I think it is cheaper than Sensodyne. But, um, this had such good reviews, again, at Target, so I picked it up there, and I wanted the activated charcoal one because it has whitening properties, so you're kind of cleaning your teeth as you're whitening them, and I really love it. The only thing is, if you can see this, um, it's very black. I mean, you can probably see. There's, like, remnants on the top. It's actually black, so... It's more of like a dark gray color. There's a little translucency to it. But I have an electric toothbrush, so it gets it's everywhere. Every, like, it, I do a pretty good job now keeping it in my mouth. But when you go to spit out, like, even if you're just, like, gently spitting, it'll get all over the sink. So I have to clean my sink, um, like, at least once a day or every two days if I'm being lazy. So that's the only downside, which a lot of people said in the reviews as well. But um, I think for the price, like, how affordable it is for being such a natural product, it's really great. And it makes your teeth feels so clean. I don't know why I didn't say that first. Mm -hmm. It truly, no, more than any other toothpaste I've ever owned, it makes them feel squeaky clean. So if you're one of those people that want your mouth to just feel just cleansed, you will love this. And I don't know how they do it. I don't know if it's the, it's charcoal, the charcoal I think, or the mint. Like it's just something about it. It makes you feel really clean. So really good find. Target, a lot of Target finds in this we video. We do. Uh, that's it. Thank you guys for watching this weekly favorites, and we'll be back next week.